Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back, welcome back. It is day 17. I don't have a whole lot to talk about today because one of our Digimon is still in the freezer and one is still Noble Pumpmon, but I do have a few things to kind of talk about a little bit. First, Noble Pumpmon. He's still glorious, as he was yesterday. Um, he is... Oh, good, perfect. A little low on strength. But the main thing I want to show you is that he is level 10. And as far as I'm aware, I have not made any care mistakes. So he should uh, digivolve to Duke Mon X or Gallant Mon X, uh, whichever name you prefer. I like Duke Mon personally. So he should evolve to Duke Mon X, I'm thinking tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. Uh, that would be swell. If he doesn't, that's okay too. Um, he'll We'll just freeze him. Uh, tomorrow night and he'll digivolve for us tomorrow after the next group hatch is over uh, I do want to go to the Colosseum so um, we can take a look at my items real fast I only have two EXP boosters at the moment and I want three for when he evolves to Duke Mon uh, because every time they evolve I have to redo their levels so uh, we're gonna go fight Omnimon really fast to deal with that. There we go. This uh, this area, area 41, is only three fights. Uh, it is Omecamon, uh, Omega Shoutmon X, and Omnimon. Uh, and the first two don't give a whole lot of experience points if you're grinding, but Man oh man, does Omega Mon or uh, Omnimon sure give a ton of experience. So if you are not already max level, that's a really good place to do it if you're strong enough anyway. Let's do it, Omega Shoutmon X. Oh boy, let's see. Concentrate. Mm, I missed, but hopefully. I mean, I am Omega level. I should, hopefully that's enough. Hit him with those pumpkin bombs. Will you use your pumpkin soup for me? Mm, not yet. It's okay. We'll get to it. He'll use it. You know, I'm not worried. He'll he'll use the soup. That's yeah. There we go. Use that soup for the win. That pumpkin soup is just the best. Look how happy he gets. It's wonderful. Alright, Omnimon. Do we roll a four? Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Not a problem at all. Let's go, Noble Pumpmon. Hit him with that pumpkin soup! Oh no, he dodged the pumpkin soup. And took a hit. Well, that's not good. Pumpkin bombs? Okay, they connected. Very good, very good. Dodge it! Yes! I love when they listen, you know? It's real good. I mean, you theoretically would just want to dodge them all, but... No, no. Strategic dodging. Like this, you're going to have to really dodge. Oh, thank God. I know. I know. Hit him with that pumpkin soup! Yes. You know what? I take it back. Hitting him with the pumpkin soup for the kills. Pretty great. Imagine being defeated by pumpkin soup like that. Imagine. The shame he must feel. Cool. So we got our EXP booster. That's all I really wanted to do with uh, Pumpmon here. Um, we can take care of him later. He's got to go to bed soon, I believe. Um... So I got some stuff in, as you can see. So I found a store that was selling all three starter decks for the new Digimon trading card game. Uh, and basically, if you bought all three at once, they gave you three sets of these sleeves. There's specifically, I think only five or four in here. They're enough for the Digitama um, in here, the Digi Egg ones. So the cards that are like Koromon, Sunomon, it's the starting cards. I'm not going to go into the cards themselves today. I think I'm going to do a, a separate video just for that. 
Um, and I did also get the, uh, I'm real, I'm real happy about the version 0.0, .0 uh, promo pack. So there's a bunch of rookie levels in here, uh, which is really cool. If you'd like to see me go through the cards and what they do, let me know in the comments below. I'll talk about them, what my thoughts on the decks are. Uh, I haven't had a chance to play with them yet, but I've had a, I spent a lot of time, you know, reading about them and looking them up and everything, and I really think they're they're quite cool. Uh, the last thing I want to show is I found this beautiful thing at a game store um, a few a little while back. I don't exactly remember remember when, and it's been sitting on my shelf, and I forgot to show it off. Uh, this is the uh, Digimon World One official soundtrack. I found it. I found it for a dollar, and it was sealed. Never been, never been touched, opened anything. I think it's really cool. <laughs> the artwork's amazing. Uh, the disc itself is also beautiful. Look at that virus Mega um, Metal Greymon Mega Metal Greymon on here. It's very cool. That's what a lot of the music on these uh, videos has been from, is uh, this bad boy right here. So, yeah, I just thought I would show that. I thought that was really neat. I've never seen one of those in person before until I found it. The last thing I want to talk about is the last community hatch just finished up. Uh, that hatch, you had to hatch a Digimon on one of the original Pendulum, Digimice Pendulum machines from either, I think it was 97 and 98, between those two years. It was really neat. I don't have any of those, so I didn't raise any from there, obviously. Uh, and also, I, I don't have a way to participate in the online battles as of right now uh, with the community. Uh, the I did order a Digimon Helper from Malaysia, so that actually shipped out today. I'm ah, so excited about it. When it comes in, I will be able to participate in online battles with all of my Digivices, which is really cool. So hopefully it'll be in before the end of this next uh, Blockbuster hatch. And one of the Digimon that I raise in this new you know, movie-oriented hatch uh, can be used to battle online. And we can do some videos about that. But the, the one that just finished up today, that, that hatch, was actually won by a buddy of mine, Purple Flurp in the Digimon community. Um, real, real nice guy, real cool guy. And uh, I was happy to hear that he won. Uh, he won with his Boltmon. And I'll, I'll show off Boltmon here. Yeah, yeah. This Frankenstein monster just uh, whooped up on everybody um, that was participating, which I think is, is pretty cool. Um, he apparently had those pendulum shakes down. I'm real happy for him. I'm glad that he got a chance to win. A whole big tournament and yeah I don't know with all of all things the Boltmon that's just super rad um, <laughs> so uh, I hope my I hope I can participate in the next tournament if I can't it'll sh for sure be the next one uh, thanks everybody for listening watching uh, everyone who comments um, shout out to purple flirt and digital dream and little Siri my buddy Ethan you know <laughs> anyone else who watches uh, my lovely girlfriend I really appreciate it and uh, I hope you guys have a lovely evening, lovely day, lovely afternoon. It's all lovely. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll catch you next time. Bye!